god, he's gonna smash down in the center. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> oh, he's huge. What's happening, Tricksters? Beatrix here. Welcome back to Pokemon Legends Arceus. Okay, so if I recall correctly, I need to fight Melly, and then I can quell Lord Electrode, Hisuian Electrode, so that's going to be fun. And then I'm hoping I can run around and find a Sneasel, because I have uh, I have Sneasler as my buddy, but I want to I wanna catch a Hisuian Sneasel, that's going to be so much fun. Sneasel's my favorite Pokemon of all time, and now it has another form. So I'm hoping I can do that in this episode, but one thing at a time, let's go face Melly. Um, well, I wanted to look at my team. Okay, Benary, Floatzil, Curlia, Luxray, Decidueye, and Arcanine. Okay. Hmm. Sure, let's leave with our canine in the front and see how it goes. All right, Melly. As a member of the Diamond Clan, my highest calling is to please Almighty Sinnoh. And right now that means I must protect my lord by stopping you where you stand. If you still wish to defeat me and gain entry to Electrode's seat, you and your little Pokemon are welcome to give it your best shot. Let's go, Skunk Tank! Give them a whiff! <laughs> Give them another whiff of your silent deadliness. Mm -hmm. I don't want a whiff of your Skunk Tank. <laughs> Sunset looks so cool. I like her outfit. <laughs> Night Slash. Okay, let's see. Yeah, let's just go for a strong style fire fang. So, oh. What the? Why? So you have three Pokemon and I have one. And by using strong style, all three of you are going to attack and my Arcanine is going to be dead. Is it worth it? It's not fair how you get to do three against one. And I can't even aim at the Zubat or the Skaroopy if I wanted to. Okay, whatever. <laughs> Uh, let's go. 36 and 44. I didn't even realize the level difference. Okay, Scrooby's looking around. Zubat's looking around. Cool. So it's just Skunk Tank. Oh no, Scrooby, use Bite. And Hypnosis, are you kidding me? Uh, but your eyes are still open. Oh, you're drowsy. not sleeping. And that's gonna take me out. Okay. Well, I can't say I didn't see that coming. Um. So, Floatzil and Decidueye are my three, my two strongest Pokemon. Let's send out Floatzil. Oh, uh, still a oh, well, normal water pulse. Huh. Wow. And I'm poisoned. Oh. Okay, so Water Pulse should take care of the Skunk Tank. Oh, I died from poison? Okay. Well, the Sigi is not going to be great with poison Pokemon. Oh, Luxray is the strongest. I didn't even notice you. Alright, let's send out Luxray. Okay, this should kill the Zubat. And I'm going to go ahead and do Strong Style 2. Oh, Zubat's only level 22. I didn't notice that. That was overkill. And it was a critical hit. <laughs> Okay, should take that nicely. Uh, how do you move twice? Alright. I guess because of the strong style. Oh. 
Alright, go Luxray. <laughs> I don't mind using three because he had three too. Oh, my Curlia can evolve. Yes, please. Let's make one thing clear. I didn't lose. You may have won, but there's a difference. There is no difference. <laughs> You're so petty. I just lacked er uh, time. Yes, I'm afraid there simply wasn't enough time for me to raise my Pokemon nice and strong. Your Pokemon were stronger than mine were. At least your skunk tank was. Your Skorupi and Zubat were pretty weak. Ah, <sighs> this could be. Could this be why Adamant is always going on and on about time being a precious thing? Oh, because it's like this time people versus the space people. Are you a space person? I, ca I can't even remember anymore. <laughs> My word, the Diamond Clan and Almighty Sinnoh are truly never-ending founts of wisdom. Yes, yes, I know what comes next. You want to know what pleases Lord Electrode, so you can make some bombs for it. Right, yeah, I gotta throw them at him. Well, I'm afraid I won't be able to help you. Because I have completely forgotten what Electrode likes. I think you're still being petty. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> What's the matter? Upset? Too bad anger doesn't make bombs. Melly's really giving you the runaround, isn't he, Sunset? Okay, so you are part of the same clan, Diamond. Huh. So the Diamond people like time, and the Pearl people like space, I think. Huh. I guess it's my fault for not telling you in advance what Electrode likes. So, here's the... Adaman! <laughs> Stop being so petty. What now? I could hear you just now, you know. Are you really going to tell this little noodle what she needs to find just like that? This is bigger than what team or clan we belong to. Oh, and by the way, I wasn't just going to tell her what she needs. <laughs> oh... And by the way, I wasn't just going to tell her that she needs crunchy salt. I was going to go right ahead and give it to her. <laughs> crunchy salt? Salt is a seasoning, not a meal. Now it's time to make some bombs, so lend a hand, both of you. <laughs> Fine! At the end of the day, let none say that the great Melly shirked his duties as warden. I'll help you make your precious bombs. Quite a change of tune after all you've been working against for me not to fight this electrode. There, I made you a practically infinite supply of bombs, so chuck all you like at electrode. But I don't under but don't underestimate my lord's strength. I very much doubt the likes of you can quell it. <laughs> all right. Well. Let's go ahead. Oh, all my buttons are mixed up. Okay, so that's the map. There we go. Save. Uh, let's see. How's my Pokemon doing? Yeah, like I... <sighs> I need to go and heal some of them, and I wouldn't mind, like, grinding my Pokemon a bit more. I was underleveled for Melee, so I may not be ready to fight Electro just yet. But let me... Let me let my Curly evolve into Gardevoir. Idea for a new move. Let's look at your moves some. So, you know, confusion, calm mind, draining, kiss, and hypnosis. You don't need hypnosis. So, let's do that. 
Looks good to me. I don't know, I kind of want to, wow, look at that rift, it's so close. I kind of want to run around and grind a little bit. Mm, I just want the tree. Ah, satchel space, Ooh, there's an Electra Buzz. I don't suppose I can just like catch you, can I? Oh gosh, this luxury is after me. Okay, that doesn't work when you're... <laughs> uh, I don't think this was the best idea. Um... I'm gonna ride. I can't, there's no way I can fight both of them. Well... Oh gosh, oh it's so huge, look at that electrifier! Wow, he's so big! Oh gosh! <laughs> wow! Fly score. Wow, what is that music? Oh, it's beautiful. Ooh, what's in this cave? Man, I just went up higher in the mountain. Oh, he's gonna stop me. Unless I have like one more star or something. Ooh, can't pick this up. Man. This is a stone portal. I've been told not to let anyone pass. Okay. Man, not even like stars required. Okay, so it goes straight to the rift, doesn't it? What if I run past you? <laughs> or sneak past you, really? Oh. <laughs> uh, you're not doing anything to stop me. You're stopping me by your mind powers. You think I'm disobedient? Man, this game is so beautiful. Alright, what's down this way? I think the game's gonna stop me from going here too. Whenever I see this fog around, they're like, oh, you can't go any further. Wow, okay, maybe I can't go here. Look at that Machamp. Maybe I can catch him. No, he's not a Machamp. He's a Machoke. How do I sneak? I always sneak accidentally. Oh, come on. I gotta catch him. That was such a beautiful throw. Come on! That was so beautiful! Now he's pissed off. <laughs> Man, you didn't even see me or anything. Okay, maybe Gardevoir can fight him. You're level 55? What the hell? Gosh, man! I don't kill me like that. Oh, you're hurt by the recoil. Oh, man. I wonder if that's enough for me to catch him. What do you mean? I didn't strafe in the battle. I did not! And he's. Is he gonna still. Is he gonna have full health again? Okay, he doesn't. No, he didn't! I'm right here! I'm right in front of you! I'm right here! Oh. Oh gosh, okay. This is perfect. I have to be able to catch him now. 
He's in the red. Come on. You'll be so helpful on my team. Excellent! <laughs> I got a level 55 choke. Wow. Okay, I really know I need to go back to camp. Is that camp down there? Oh, I remember this place. I was there before. This is where the Dialga and Plakia statues are. Let's see. Let's look at my Pokemon. Right, I have these Pokemon with me because I want them to, like, level up. Like, I want my Baneri to evolve. <sighs> but, you know, it's always the balance you have to strike. Okay, I have two Hisuian Voltorbs. Wow. Right, and I have a Gabite. I mean, a Gibble. It's only level 20. Like, things like this, I would love to train this, but... It's gonna take a while and it'll be, like, hindering my team until then. Alright, let's do this! Let's quell Electrode! So, even knowing you're doomed to fail, you still wish to pit yourself against Electrode. I'm ready! <laughs> Heh. You have a great deal more pluck than you have sense. I'll give you that. A word of advice, don't stop moving while you're battling Electrode or you'll be dead in no time. He's gonna roll over me like a boulder in those Indiana Jones movies. <laughs> How big is he gonna be? Oh, look at all those Voltorbs! They're so cute! Oh god, he's gonna smash down in the center. <laughs> I love it! <laughs> oh, he's huge! He's upside down! Oh, I should have known by the colors. <laughs> Lord of the Hollow Electrode. <laughs> what an entrance! Wow, okay. Uh, let's not let him. Okay. Okay, uh, let's not get hit by these things. Oh gosh, okay. I can't, I can't let those hit me. Wow, you're raining down Voltorb to help you out. Okay, where's my- okay, that's my- I- man, I hate that the run button for the creatures and the human is different. Okay, and this is to jump out of the way. Okay, good. Ow! Oh, what the hell? Man, I love this game. I love how we fight Pokemon like one on one. Uh, okay, I'll go Decidueye! Did I miss my chance? <laughs> okay, I'll do better next time. <laughs> Melly wasn't kidding, huh? <laughs> Whoa. Ah, uh, how do I, like. Oh, I need to go outside of this range? Is that how I. Uh, Okay, now go to Sidui. Forty six. Not too bad. We got this. Aww. Okay, gonna do a strong style. Air Ice! <laughs> That's pretty 
Regen. Yeah! And it was 20, so. And I can't move. Almost. And I avoided. Go to Stitching Y. Avoid it again. Yes! Now it's my turn. I got you. Okay. There you go. You like balls, huh? Eat these. <laughs> I love him. He looks so cool. Okay. Man, but I... Man, I didn't heal at all. I can't, I got hurt so much during the first round. How am I gonna do like three or four rounds of these? Does my Pokemon get healed? Is Decidueye okay? Okay, yeah, he's fine. All right. Ah, man, no, I can't start off like that. Just two hits right off the bat. Gotta run, gotta run. Are you exploding? Oh, run! Oh, I'm gone. I can't let that hit me. Okay. Run. I gotta... I gotta get outside of this range! Okay. Go on, this is UI. Everything. Are you exploding again? No, is it your ball or rain shower? Oh. oh, I just realized. I'm using wind attacks because grass is weak to flying, but electric resist flying, so I'm just using neutral instead of super effective. Okay, that's fine though. I don't have any ground Pokemon. Alright. Oh, I'll still go with this UI. When he faints, I'll do someone else. Maybe Luxray. Could he resist? I don't know. Oh, don't die. Yes, you missed. Okay. Maybe I, so then I should use this because at least it's stab. If I'm going to be using something neutral, then I should at least get you know stab damage. Wow. Yeah, his defense went down. Uh, oh, it was a critical hit. Okay. But well, cool, I'll take it. I 
cara. Rosemary is possible. <laughs> okay, he's like less than half. That's good. You can do it, sunset. Just keep dodging. No! 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 Come on, sunset. You can do it. You gotta stay outside of all those rings. Keep running. Wow. Okay, I got this. I can do this. And now he's gonna explode again. You got this, Sunset. Get out the range, get off the range, get out of range. Wow. All right. <laughs> One last hit, the Sidui. Hey, I sent out the Sidui. I sent him out. Oh gosh, I hate that I lost. Oh gosh, that is bull crap. Ugh. Okay, are you exploding again? Man, that is some bull. Hopefully, I've mastered the art of. Dodging all of these attacks, though. Don't stop. Just keep going. Okay. Come on. Get out. Get out. Get out. Oh, wow. Okay. I don't know how I missed it last time. Aww, miss, yes, my turn. Mm. Well, let me go. Miss your thugger again, man. <laughs> you did good, the Sidui. Okay, let's ray. You know, I probably shouldn't have brought Float Bill with me. It's bleak to electric and grass. What was I thinking? Okay, let's do a strong crunch. Yes! Ooh. Okay, run! Run! Okay, we got this, we got this. We know how to dodge him now. Man, this yellow beam, this blue beam is like right on my tail though, what the hell? I got this. Man, it is right on me. This is it, this is it, this is it, this is the last one. I just gotta get out. Just gotta get out. Ooh. Okay. Come on, let's race. You got this. There's your ball. Goodness gracious, that took a lot. Oh, nice! Oh, that was good. So, this is gonna take me out and weaken it for the next person. Gardevoir, you got this! Oh, is Gardevoir, Gardevoir or Arcanine? Gardevoir, because then Arcanine is gonna die to the grass attack. But then it'll be neutral because I'm fire too. Oh, whatever. Gardevoir, you got this. You just gotta... Well, no, I lowered his defense, but now Gardevoir gets with special attack. Oh, gosh. Okay, whatever. Um, Dashing Blaine. Yes! I got you! This is it. Man, how did I miss the first one? This is it! This is the end of the world for you, Electrode! 
Oh, that was fun. You're so huge. One for the road. Your favorite food, crunchy salt. <laughs> you salty electric grass ball. Hey, you feel better now, don't you? <laughs> nice. Oh, I didn't even use my choke. It didn't even occur to me. What the hell? My choke would have made it so easy. <laughs> Ooh, you're cool. Why didn't I use my choke? <laughs> no, I'm glad. Zap plate from Electrode. Mm, I'm glad I used my OGs. Electricity. How many of those do I have now? Oh, for shame! What utter calamity! Are you impressed with me? <laughs> I agreed to make those accursed bombs, yes, but now that Almighty Sinnoh's precious blessing has vanished forever, it's just so unbearably sad. Is that how you see it? Electrode looks relieved to me. Glad its suffering's ended, probably. But if Almighty Sinnoh grows angry with me because of this, I don't know what I'll do. Ingo, I arrive right on schedule. Now what do you bother coming back for? Only to say that I recalled some things after sunset did me the honor of traveling with me. The ones we call Pokemon trainers were truly devo devoted to their craft. They always looked towards the next challenge and had Pokemon vitals every chance they got. All to help themselves and their Pokemon grow. If Pokemon and people work together, we can forge new paths forward. We'll be lost to history if we go on believing only Pokemon can be strong, or if we go on fearing them instead of understanding them. Interesting, was your world like Ingo described to Sunset? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, what should I say? I mean, I assume so because I think she comes from the future where po people in Pokemon live in harmony. But is she ready to recall those specific details? I don't think I remember. Pokemon and people working together in close harmony, huh? Could our nobles' frenzies be some kind of test after all? To see if we can achieve that kind of harmony as we flail around trying to fix things? Of course, your higher state is clear, Sunset. It surely lies with the next lord. <laughs> Whew, I can't wait to see who it's going to be. Now, this time, I really will make the complete return trip to Jubilife Village. Now, begging your pardon, I owe Commander Kamado my report. Until next time, Sunset. Huh, I think I'm going to speak to Kamado as well. Oh, well, that was really fun. That Pokemon Lord Quell battle did not disappoint, as usual. It was very exciting and action-packed. This Pokemon game is really unique because I'm playing a lot of Pokemon Violet these days, but it's so cool to just like interact with the Pokemon in the wild and have them attack me and everything. That's such an amazing, freeing feeling. <laughs> Alright, well, let's go back to camp. Um, how's my Pokemon doing? Okay, not bad. So it's only Luxury and Decidueye that got fainted. Gardevoir is quite alright. Come on, do some... Oh wow, there's a Raged Onyx down there. Whoa. Oh, you're such a natural at climbing. 
Wow, look at that onyx. Ow. Get me out of here. There's a Rage Steelix. You have a Rage Onyx next to a Rage Steelix. What the hell? Ooh, let me get that Chimecho. I know it's it's pronounced Chimeco, but I always called it Chimecho as a kid. Can I fight the Chimecho without fighting the Steelix? You ran away. I wanted to catch you. Dude, there's a regular onyx. You're allergic to water. So I'll just use a weak water attack on you. Don't die, I wanna catch you. Oh, ow! Uh, but no, I... It might be too strong if I need to hit him again. But let me just throw a ball for now. Anyway, Ooh. okay. Sneezler. Ursaring. It's not raged, is it? <laughs> Ursaring. Alright, um. Training kiss. Pokemon. camp as quickly as possible. Oh, there it is. Right in front of me. Okay, let's take a little nap. Heal my Pokemon. Alright. Let's go back home. Oh nice, I've caught 15 Pokemon, that's awesome. Yes! Well, look at all the Pokemon! <laughs> Yanma, Yanmega, Bronzor, Bronzong, Gliscor, 
Gibbo nose pass, Sudowoodo nose pass, Voltor, Voltor, Machoke, Haunter, Onyx, and Ursaring. <laughs> Observations. <laughs> okay. Better. Yes! Oh, that is so many points. I'm so happy. That's good. Because <laughs> I'm pretty sure once I talk to the warden, I'm going to have to earn my next star before I can do anything. So I'm glad I'm more than halfway there. <laughs> nice. Sounds good to me. All right. Let's see. Man, I haven't. I didn't run into any sneezels. You'd think that'd be the area. You wanted to know about Magikarp, the Pokemon up there. I think I haven't caught any Magikarps. You do hairstyles. Any new quests you want from me so that you can have new clothes? Okay, warmer down. Okay. <sighs> I'll keep an eye open. Warden Melly believes that the frenzies of these Pokemon are some sort of trial sent by Almighty Sinnoh. We cannot know if that is the case or not, but it does beg the question, why ever would this Almighty Sinnoh drive the nobles into frenzy? Hmm, but you must be tired. Go on then, to the Wallflower. Get some rest while you can. Oh yes, Potato Monkey! <laughs> I've instructed Benny to prepare you his finest potato mochi. <laughs> mochi. I don't know. Mochi or mochi? Uh, I want to try potato mochi. This sounds so comforting. With Rie and the professor. Dinner's on Kamado tonight. Eat your fill. Oh, what's with his face? Levinson, what? What an exciting aroma. My appetite just went through the roof. This is generous for the boss. You let your actions do the speaking for you. Sunset and the message is clear as day. It doesn't matter one whit where you came from. You're part of the Sword of a Corps and Jubilife village now. Mwah. <laughs> Family and community. I like it. <laughs> Next day, talking to Kamado again. Do my morning stretches. Isn't it nice getting up early? <laughs> Is it? It's not as if getting up early changes what you can do with the day. It kind of does. If you get up early, you have more time. If you, you're you on time for things, you don't miss deadlines. Like if you had an 8 o'clock deadline, you wake up at 9, then you missed it. Early to bed, early to rise, makes a man healthy, wealthy, and wise. I don't know. <laughs> Yes, it does. <laughs> exactly. It opens up possibilities such as responding to Commander Commodore's invitation today in a timely manner. You've now quelled the frenzy of four nobles. <laughs> yeah, I'll be humble. When word of these frenzies arrive from all over Hisui, I feared we that I feared what would become of us. 
But here we are already preparing to quell the final noble. Wow, there's only five nobles? <laughs> Man, so why do I have so many stars still to earn? The only lord... Oh, Avalug! I love Avalug! The only lord left to be quelled is Avalug, which lives in the Alabaster Icelands. Wow, is that where I can find Sneasel? I don't know if Hesilian Sneasel st is still an ice type. I don't know. Avalug is my favorite ice Pokemon. So Sneasel is my favorite Pokemon of all time, and Sneasel is a dark and ice type, so you'd think that Sneasel is my favorite ice type Pokemon, but no way. Avalug is my favorite ice type Pokemon. He's so easy to use competitively. It's a defensive beast. It has a lot of, it has such high defense and high HP. And then it has low special attack, but it has the ability Sturdy and also the move Mirror Move. So if I have full HP, then someone comes and hits me with a special attack and I'm hit down to my Sturdy with one HP and then I give myself a berry to give myself half my health back and I use Mirror Move and I obliterate them. <laughs> it's so much fun to use. I love Avalug so much. It's my favorite Pokemon. So I play Pokemon competitively. And yeah, Avalug and its defensive strategies is just one of the most fun Pokemon to battle with. I know that Hisuian Avalug it has a different form. I think it's rock and ice. I've just seen it around in Violet, so that's another reason why I want to come and finish this game. I can preserve as many secrets as possible. But yeah, Avalug, that's gonna be fun. <laughs> Yeah, and I need to come and I need to finish Pokemon Legends Arceus before Pokemon Legends AZ comes out, so maybe we're nearing the end of the game if this is the final Lord to quell. Alabaster Icelands. He is also the largest of the nobles, according to what Irida told me. Not surprised. <laughs> Your mission is to quell Avalon, the final lord. And perhaps in doing so, we may trigger some change in the space-time rift as well. I wonder who the Warden of Avalug is going to be. What their personality is like. Hmm, sure thing. Yeah! <laughs> uh, oh god, what happened? Are you okay? Oh, Wormful! Abra teleported this Wormful outside at once! <laughs> Oh, wait, no, Alabra, teleport it at once! Are you afraid of bugs, Selene? Abra? Ahem. <laughs> I'll just pretend that didn't happen. So, you're to survey the Alabaster Icelands next. This is the most treacherous climb you'll face in all history. If you intend to go, Show me you're equal to the challenge by earning your fifth star. Witness Pokemon using moves in various styles. Catch Pokemon at different times. Complete such research tasks to raise your rank and aid with any requests that might be found on the professor's blackboard. I guess I haven't looked at requests in a while. So that's another way I can raise my rank. All right, well, sounds good. I'll do some grinding. I'll change my clothes. And next time we can be on our way to quell Avalug. <laughs> so that was fun. I love quelling Electro. This game is still just as fun as ever. <laughs> love all the adventure and exploring. Maybe in the Alabaster Wastelands or Icelands Alabaster Icelands. Maybe there I'll get to see Sneasel. We'll see, I know it's in this game somewhere. <laughs> Alright, thanks for joining me. I'll see you on the next adventure, the next episode of Pokemon Legends Arceus. Bye!